uh, Tony Rungsawang. I'm a director and cinematographer. I submitted two films, Good Person and Car Park Blues. Uh, first thing that came to my mind was, you know, one take, one shot, and then it kind of just came from, it just went from there, like I wanted to just have very few characters and tell just a really quick story with one shot. So that's sort of what happened, and that's how it came to be, I guess. I wanted to be able to tell this story in sort of like a nonchalant way, like sort of show a, get a homosexual relationship in a nonchalant way, because usually when I see it, it's sort of like really like superimposed that this is a homosexual thing, but I wanted it to be like, yeah, it's just another relationship. These two movies have very different uh, looks and styles of shooting. Uh, so with Good Person, I wanted to have like as clean of camera movement as I could have gotten. So I used a Ronin and I shot with a Canon 70D because it has some decent autofocus. Uh, with Car Park Blues, I wanted to shoot it in anamorphic, so I used a, an anamorphic projector lens. I have the FM anamorphic adapter lens. Uh, I wanted the camera to be have, to have that like realistic handheld shake look. So I used like a shoulder rig and stuff and shot it on a GH5. And yeah, cause it has good anamorphic capabilities. They were both like one take, so it wasn't much editing. It's just post-production color, basically. I just used Adobe Premiere Pro to do color grading because it's simple and it's what I know. Like other people would probably use DaVinci and stuff, but I don't know how to do that. I'm not about that, fam. Mm -hmm.